Hey there, in this video I'm going to show you how to create this zoom in on hover effect in Figma. So starting with the design, I'll take you through the entire process, going from design, setting up the interaction, and then changing the images so it's not just the same image and we can apply it to different cards. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to design my card. So I'm going to grab the frame tool and draw out one of the cards, and I'm going to make it 280 by 400, so I have some nice round numbers. And the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to duplicate this frame. Well, first, I'll rename it card. And next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to duplicate this card. So Control C, Control V, and then I'm going to rename this duplicate one image. And I'm going to make it so this image is a child of the card frame. And the reason I'm doing that, instead of just having the image in the card, is because when I scale up the image, I want to be able to center it using these position properties right here. So in the image frame, I'm going to go add in an image in the fill. I'm going to select one of the images. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to duplicate this image one more time to make it a sibling. And this duplicate copy on the top, I'm gonna to remove the image fill, and I'm gonna add a linear gradient, just so we have some contrast on the bottom so we can read the text. So on the top, I'm gonna to make it transparent. And on the bottom, I'm gonna make it black and bring the opacity full 100. And for linear gradient, I'll make the opacity 60%. And then what I'll do is on the top one that has the linear gradient, I'll just rename it gradient. And I'll grab my text tool. I'm going to zoom in. And I'll just drop in the text. And I'll write the city name. And I'll just make this 20 by 30, 20 size, 30 line height with a negative two letter spacing, letter negative two percent letter spacing. And I'll just make it so it's 28 from the left and 28 pixels from the bottom. So we have some padding. And if we zoom out. We can see our card design. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to grab my card and I'm going to move it somewhere off of my frame or my web design because I want to be able to make it a component and then make a component on the zoomed in state. So I'm going to grab my card. I'm just going to move it off of my design for right now. And I'm going to duplicate the card. So I'm going to hold Alt and drag. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to name the card. So on this first one, I'm going to rename it card slash regular. And this duplicate copy, I'm going to call it card slash hover. And then on the hover card, I'm going to twirl down and select the image. And I'm just going to scale it up ever so slightly so it's subtle. So I'm going to hold down shift and slightly scale it up. And then I'll center it back up. And I'll select both of the cards. And I'll go here to the components icon and I'll hit create component set. Now that I have my two cards, the regular and the hover, I'm going to go to prototype and I'm going to select the regular. And on this button right here with the plus icon, I'm going to drag it towards the hover card. And then the interaction details comes up. I'm going to make it while hovering. Change it to smart animate, make it ease out. 
And we'll just leave it at the default for 300 for right now. And then what you'll see is if we go to the regular card, hold down Alt and drag a copy back onto our design. You'll notice that when we go back and preview the design, then we hover over our card, it zooms in, and as soon as the mouse goes off, it zooms out. And the cool thing about this is that once we duplicate these cards back to our design, hold down Alt and duplicate so we have four of them spanning the entire container is that we can go in to any one of these cards and replace the image so I'll replace the image take the city and then when we test out the new one the effect stays there. And that's how you create a zoom in on hover card in Figma. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.